Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking the body to be down here, Michael, at your service on this hump day. I am not pumped today. It's one of those days where I'm just like that. Having said that, it is bicep day, and I'm going to do a little bit of leg workout using the Smith machine for a vertical leg press. Uh, we're not going to do a whole lot of filming. I just wanted to kind of, you know, come to my people's and say hi. And uh, right now we got, we're just now getting started. We got 54 pounds going here. The bar is 34. We got 10s on each side. If you would, like, share, subscribe, comment. Wanna? Let's do some curls, guys. Ugh. One of those days. <sighs> One of those days. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. So along with these, uh, after I do six sets of these, uh, I'm also going to do six sets of chest supported dumbbell curls where you're leaning on the incline and uh, no real weights that I'm looking at going to, just trying to get a good workout. Um, so anyway, uh, yeah, I'm a little stressed today. The kids on the bus are really getting to me this year, and I've had to ride them up and ride them up and ride them up. And oh boy, there's a parenting problem in this country. There's a whole adult problem in this country. So uh, respect goes out to all the child care providers teachers, other faculty, and us bus drivers. Uh, I don't wish it on anyone. Not in this day. So, anyway, let's move on to another set. And uh, I don't know what I'll film. I'm not going to film much. So, uh, we'll just get like a couple of clips of each movement. So, you guys keep doing your thing. And uh, whatever it is, I don't care what you're doing. Just enjoy and take care of yourself, okay? We'll see you on the next clip. And, uh, yeah. All right, guys. We got 144. Bars 34. Two fives, two tens, a 25. Plus the clips. This is my last set. I am going to move when I do this. Buildings, trees, and bridges all move. For why? For longevity so they don't break and snap. Your body is the same way. You got to move. movement we're going to do some chest supported dumbbell curls and we're not going to go heavy I'm probably just going to stick with one weight for this uh, for all six sets and uh, right now I got the 30s and that'll probably be what I stick with so uh, I went a little bit heavier uh, with the barbells so I'm going to go just a smidgen lighter with the dumbbells and uh, yeah so let's get this movement going and uh, we're one step closer to being done One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, if I decide to do a heavier weight, which I hope I don't. If I decide to, though, I'll do another clip. Otherwise, uh, I'll see you on the vertical leg press and uh, another step closer to being done. And uh, 
So guys, stick with me. Hope you like, share, subscribe, comment to the body beat down. Let's build a good community, big, helpful, fun, good community. And uh, whew, let's get uh, ourselves healthy inside and out. Uh, one little workout at a time, one meal at a time, one sip of water, and one good night's sleep at a time. All right, we'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, we're on to our vertical leg press. This is 237 pounds. If you want to challenge that, let me know. Uh, go check on my community page. I posted a link to the video I did where I weighed the bar. This bar plus this carriage right here weighs 57 pounds. That's 57 pounds no matter if it's free weight or on a track system. It doesn't matter. It's 57 pounds. We got 245s, and that comes up to 237 pounds. So let's do some vertical leg presses. I'm not going up heavy because I just did legs Monday, and I'm still sore. This is just to get blood flowing a little bit more, some oxygen going through there, and try to help flush out that lactic acid or battery acid or bleach. I don't know what it is. There's something in there I'm trying to flush out. I don't know. So let's do some leg presses. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ho oh, oh, ho oh. Get it going. <laughs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. All right, I got five more sets of these to do. I'm probably not going to go up any more weight. Again, this is just to get blood and oxygen and all that good stuff flowing through there. Uh, to kind of help with the soreness and uh, a little bit of recovery even. It's kind of a little bit uh, called a recovery workout is what I'll call these whenever I do something like this. So uh, anyways, we'll uh, catch you on the closing of the video. I'm going to finish up these five sets. And uh, everybody stick around. Uh, have a good workout, whatever it is you're doing. Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, please. And uh, let me get done. I need to get done. Let me get done. All right, everybody, so just like that, we are done with the workout today. Nothing too crazy, but it was a good workout nonetheless. Uh, my biceps are going to feel pretty good. I can tell that. Uh, pretty good little pump there. I went up just heavy enough to where I was having to move a little bit there. And the vertical leg press, just enough to get some flow and some movement going in the legs. Of course, I, I still walk and I still spin on the bike and all that, but it's good to get a little bit of weight on them again and uh, kind of help flush things through uh, plenty of water as well so uh, <clears throat> yeah I hope you enjoyed the video just a quick little video today again stop hating on Smith machines guys if you use any machine in the gym then you're guilty of using a machine it doesn't matter if it's Smith cable plate loaded pin select whatever the case may be hydraulic I don't care what it is. If you're using any sort of machine, you're guilty of using a machine. And I've seen people commenting here lately, not just on my videos, but other people's videos about how much the bar weighs. You don't know how much the bar weighs because you're not weighing that bar. So uh, some Smith machines have a counterbalanced bar, which takes some of the weight off of it. So if it even was a 45, 57 pound bar, uh, an apparatus carriage, then the weights kind of help counterbalance some of that and you don't have that full weight. This is not. This is full 57 pounds and that's 57 pounds regardless if it's on those guide rods or if I'm free bench pressing a, a bar. Uh, it's 57 pounds. So quit hating on the Smith machine. Uh, it's a, an incredible machine that allows you to do all kinds of stuff and uh, you're not going to do vertical leg presses on free weights. I'll bet you that. I bet you. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Got a little something out of it. Please leave comments. Good comments. Be helpful and friendly and awesome. Uh, we're trying to build a, a nice, good, friendly community here, guys. 
and to push away the negativity that's out there in the fitness community especially. So, uh, yeah, i got to get a shower. We're going to go out and grab a bite to eat. Hopefully some place that has a good steak. Ah, I can't wait. Maybe I'll get my other 200 grams of protein in there. Speaking of which, check my community tab out where I mentioned something about protein. Now, since I, uh, I'll just go ahead and touch on it, but since I've been following bodybuilding and all that, started working out in the 90s, uh, the general consensus is you need a gram of protein per body pound. Well, I'm usually around 250 pounds. So that means I need to roughly be getting about 250 grams of protein a day. There's no way I'm getting that much. Uh, I'm lucky probably to get 100 grams. I'm not going to lie. So... Uh, Imagine, if you will, if we actually consumed the, the proper amount of protein that we're supposed to be getting, uh, what that might could do to your physique. You know, I've been going at this hard and heavy for two years now without getting all the protein that I need. And I'm where I'm at uh, right now. Uh, and, and I wonder where I would be if I was getting all the protein I need to be. Would my body look a little different? Would I be stronger? I don't know. So anyway, just something to think about, guys. And I, I don't want to get on the argument or debate of meats and vegetables and all that kind of stuff. Uh, you eat what you want. I know there's a lot of vegans and vegetarians and other sort of words, groups, whatever. So everybody just do your own thing, but try to, try to eat as healthy as you can and make sure proteins are the most important thing in your diet. All right? Like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the Body Beat Down. That's me, Michael, your long haired, sexy host. Oh, God, not even. Anyway, get up, get out, get ready, do it to it. We'll see you next time on the Body Beat Down. Get up, get out, get ready, do it to it.